all that, she keyed her husband's car, then set his closets and bed on fire. The flames got out of control quickly. No one was hurt, though. She is now facing arson charges. In Phoenix, two young kids left alone for a while in a motel. Police called out to this Motel 6 near 51st Avenue in McDowell. They're said to be just one and six years old. Security called police when they heard those kids playing in the room. Officers found mom, brought her back to the hotel. She says she was working nearby. Police say DCS has been notified. Developing now a search in Massachusetts. Police looking for a man and a woman who walked away unharmed after their car was split in two by a train. Just take a look at these images. Police say the driver was reportedly trying to get away from another driver who he'd hit. Investigators say the impact with the train happened after the driver went around the lowered crossing gates. To Illinois now. Investigators back out today trying to figure out what caused this gas explosion. One person was killed. He's just been identified as 38-year-old Arturo Silva Jr. Several others are hurt. Nearby homes and businesses in the community just outside of Peoria just rocked by this blast. Investigators say it happened while utility workers were trying to fix a gas leak. Quite a border bus to tell you about. Uh, this is coming from U.S. Border Patrol agents now.